Alliance for Community Action presents a radio drama entitled Let's Participate. So listen and participate. So tell us more, Muyangan, about the annual general meeting which we'll be having next week. You seem to have some information at least. You know, there hasn't been much publicity about it. Mm, what publicity are you talking about, Selina Naiwe? You mean you haven't read the post on the WhatsApp group? Selina is right, Muyangan. That post you are talking about was only shared a few days ago and it does not even have enough information. The executive is supposed to put a notice about the AGM at least 30 days in advance. You are right, my amigo. But what can we do? You people and I are just members. We just have to wait until the executive feels it fit to communicate. Anyway, the news is that Madaliso is recontesting his seat as operations manager. Okay. Yes, and he has asked me to be his campaign manager. Ah, <laughs> that's a known fact. Since you guys are best friends. But Miangan, you are wrong to say that we just have to wait until when the executive feels it is fit to communicate. The executive should not hold on to information. They are just supposed to share with us, the members. We are supposed to know how the affairs of our association are being implemented. Ah, no, my amigo. Stop misleading us. Where on earth have you heard that common members like ourselves are supposed to know how the affairs of the association are run? It is happening in so many countries and associations that are transparent. That is why there is need for us to have access to information police. I think that would be better. And I don't understand why they give it a deaf ear whenever we advocate for an access information policy. Ah, to be honest with you guys, me, I'm very disappointed with my daddy, so I mean. I wouldn't even advise him to stand for any position in the executive. In fact, all the members should be voted out this time around. Mm, but why are you disappointed with Madaliso? Is he the only person in the executive? I think you just hate him. It's not about hate here, Muyangan. Madaliso is an artist just like us. The rest of the members in the executive are not. That guy is supposed to represent us well in the meeting. He knows what our challenges are in this industry. But I was sure. <laughs> I think, my amigo, you are very right on this one. My dad is used to be our darling. Uh, 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 very much. Yes. We used to complain together when he was just a mere member like us. But we don't know what has gotten into him nowadays. Especially after being voted for into the executive. Let's just say that the guy is now corrupt. I think uh, so, uh, 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 uh. I think you are now going too far, my amigo. <laughs> How can you utter such serious allegations against my best friend? You should mind the way you talk. This should be the first and last you dare say such nonsense. <laughs> <laughs> but why are you getting annoyed, Miangan? Ah, Nishina, you are corrupt, can't you? Have you heard what your friend is saying, Selina? Our guys, let's respect each other. Please, don't try me. I will forget I'm a campaign manager. How dare you talk to me like that? But I don't know why you are... Ah, shut up, Mbuzi. Ah, Muyangana, you're calling me Mbuzi, ine. Okay. If I'm a god, then you're a cockroach yourself. You can't be calling uh -huh, me Mbuzi. Guys, ah, guys, well, ah, she can't be calling me Mbuzi. Miangana, Miangana, ah, 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 well, she can't ah, be calling me Mbuzi, ah, ah. Naiwe. Ah, ah. Access to information is an essential tool in the fight against corruption. It increases accountability and transparency and allows the identification and uncovering of corrupt practices. Ah, guys, stop it! Ah, ah, na imu. Guys, ah, ah, my amigo, mi angana. Ah, guys, ah, mi angana na imu. Seize your fire, guys. I think mi angana, you are missing a point here. What is here is that our executive is just doing things their way. Eh? They've just forgotten that it is us members who put them in power. Mm, yes, we are the ones. And it's like Madali, so he's not doing anything about it at uh, all. Uh, I'm with you, Miami, on this uh, one. Oh, so you are taking sides, Selina. What huh? about taking sides? Okay, let it be. You think I can be afraid of you? Yes, let it be. Especially if you are from being corrupted and then you want to come here in a machik. Uh, <laughs> are you listening, Selina? No, guys, listen. The matter we are discussing here is very important. Ah. And it needs sober-minded persons. Yes. Let us learn to disagree in principle without causing any violence. Mind you, friendship is very important, guys. This discussion should not cause any fight, please. But what kind of access to information do you people want? Doesn't Madaliso share about the activities of the association? 
And you guys have also been participating in the same activities. Yes, we have participated before. But just participating is not enough. Hmm. Do you know the total amount of grants that we have received for activities from our sponsors this year? If I may ask you yourself, you. There is no point in knowing how much the total grant was. As long as our association is kept alive with some activities here and there, it is good enough. No, Muyangana. That is where the problem is. We as members pay our monthly subscriptions. Mm -hmm. Yes. And make mm -hmm. many other contributions to the association. Mm. We have the right to know. Remember, remember that in the previous AGM, this same executive failed to produce a financial report. Mm. Up to uh, now, yes. they still haven't released it yet. What are they hiding from us? What are they hiding? Yes, even from the other past AGM. Mm. The financial report came in block figures. I still have some of those copies of reports to show. How can we know that the funds were appropriately utilized without a proper breakdown of expenditure? Mm. It is not that we want to fight here when we talk, Meanga. We just want the right thing to be done. You see? That is why access to information policy is needed. In order for our members to hold our leaders accountable, without fear or favor. Yes. Usha, what is the same access to information which you keep on mentioning, Kanshi? Access to information is the right to access information held by public bodies. It is a fundamental human right that is essential for the functioning of a democratic society. Access to information is critical for enabling citizens to exercise their voice to effectively monitor and hold government to account and to enter into informed dialogue about decisions which affect their lives. Exactly. Mm. Ah. Access to information is also an essential tool in the fight against corruption. It increases accountability and transparency and allows identification and uncovering of corrupt practices. For example, in the government or in any other association, it helps fight corruption and with good financial mismanagement. Okay, I see. Now help me understand this, guys. Especially as citizens of this country, how can access to information help? You have asked very well, Myangan. National access to information laws allow citizens, civil societies and others to demand information about the decisions of public bodies. So even for our association, it should be the same. Okay. You see, Myangan, information enables the public to participate in the scrutiny of the association or government activities and to have the rightful say in the development of anti-corruption policies and laws and to monitor their enforcement. Okay. You see, Myangan, even for our leaders, it is very important for them to open up to their members. They should be able to declare their assets. Yes. Because opening up their finances of public officials to public scrutiny deters corruption and improves public trust in government. Yes. Okay, now I see. And I think you guys are very right. Our executive is taking us for granted. Ah, hey. <coughs> oh, sure. They What's are. What's in a no answer, guys? And if we don't voice out their wrongs, the situation can become worse. Our when is on. Manje apa, enough is enough. Mm -hmm. Yes, enough is we enough. We have to speak out. Yes. Manje muziwa, guys. Mm. We have to think about a strategy which we can use to have our voices heard. I think the best strategy is to start by having some one-on-one -on -one lobbying advocacy talks with these members of our executive who are normally on our side to support us with the access to information policy. Mm. Yes. And for example, Madam Chimwemo and Mr. Kachakwera. Ah, uh, yes, indeed. But let's not forget to include Madaliso. Mm. <laughs> I mean, we should not lose hope in him. Mm. Mm. <laughs> you know, he's our friend, and so it is easy to approach him. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> you also about Madaliso. I've never seen my campaign manager, but my temper, so I'm sure. I'm sorry, guys. <laughs> <laughs> Let's Participate was brought to you by the Alliance for Community Action. In this episode, Muyangana was Catherine Samakai. Mayamiko was Esther Banda. Selina was Messi Naulapka. It was directed by Taunga Temboliwewe. <laughs>